The Shute family says it's day three of living a nightmare, not knowing where their loved one is. Mr. Shute suffers from memory loss and is insulin dependent. That's why they say it's important they find him. They say search efforts have been tough because of the cold weather, though, but they say despite the cold, they're not going to stop searching. This is not how the Shutes plan to welcome the new year. We just be optimistic about it, and you know what I mean? We just want to find our dad. Brandon Shute says his family is looking for his father, 65-year-old Clarence Shute Jr. He was our last seen wearing a gray pair of church slacks, black shoes, and a red vest. Uh, he is about 5'8", 200 pounds, a head full of gray hair. Shute said his father was last seen Sunday morning in the parking lot of First Baptist of Carver Home off Whitney Street in Mobile. But Shute says his dad never made it into service. Every Sunday routine, you know, he does the same thing every week. You know, everywhere that he has to go, somebody has to take him. He's, no, he's not driving, mm -hmm. none of that. The last time they seen him, they seen him walk through this area here, and by the time that they swung the block to get him with the traffic and everything that he was gone. You know, it was no sign of him. Shoot says it's not like his father to wander off, but he says he suffers from memory loss and he's diabetic on heavy medication. Right now, the family is holding on to their faith, hoping someone has seen their loved one or knows where he is. So we know he's not in the best of shape. He probably walking around stumbling uh, somewhere laid down. Mm -hmm. Uh, however, he, he may he, he might have even slipped into a diabetic coma. We don't know. We just want to locate him. Now, the Mobile Police Department put out an advisory on Mr. Shoot. Anyone with information on him is asked to call police right away. Live in the newsroom, Asha Staples, Fox 10 News.